<laughs> so don't throw anything at me. <laughs> Again, thank you guys for the time. Um, thank you for the ability to submit um, the proposal for the space at the Greens. Um, a little bit about our company. We are a restaurant operations group, uh, multi-million dollar out of uh, Conway, Arkansas. And we have been working with the economic development uh, sector of the city of Sherwood for a little bit over a year now to try to figure out what we could bring to the city of Sherwood and its possibilities. Um, that's included dry lands, any, uh, uh, sorry, land or any place for uh, lease. Um, we could never really work or figure out what worked for us and our concepts that we wanted to bring. It was then told to us that there was a potential for a spot uh, for a lease that was coming up at the Greens. Um, I'm familiar with that space. I've seen that space, golf there. <clears throat> Anybody that's in business knows that it's a very good opportunity. So my partners and I sat down and drafted an RFP. And in that RFP, it states that the bids were going to be open. Um, we were going to submit a bourbon and a uh, bar, a bourbon bar concept that had a uh, barbecue kind of menu with it. Our lead chef has developed two of the most premier restaurants here in the city of Little Rock. So we felt very confident about that. We submitted a bid close to $20 a square foot and had at least all improvements going in of upwards and over $100,000 into the space. Um, we felt very strong about our community work and our other communities that we serve and we knew that we wanted to be in Sherwood. All that we're asking, as Mr. Alafonte stated, is for a fair shake in the bid process. Um, I understand the current tenant's um, position. Again, we are not trying to throw anybody out of the place. We were just trying to follow legal action in the bidding process. That is it. And the only thing that we ask is just as y'all are asking to be heard, that we're asking to be heard and our bid be open as well. And in hopes that we can um, put a, a good faith partnership going forward with the city if the uh, Parks and Rec and the Council decides to move that way. Thank you. Shannon. 